chapter 8, verse 14. I'm spreading that I learned by the Spirit of God. They are the sons of God. What qualifies us to be the Son of God is worship. So anytime we find ourselves worshiping the Lord, we are telling God we want to be your son, we want to be your daughter. Romans chapter 8, verse 14. For as men that are led by the Spirit of God, we are the sons of God. Not those who are led by God. Not those who are led by the principle of men. Not those who are led by the performance of human approach. But men who are led by the Spirit of God. If you are led by God, I will not get into a mistake. If God is not living, nobody will talk out of grace. As many that are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God. But that was in Romans chapter 8, verse 7, verse, verse 9. But ye are not in flesh, but in spirit. So being that the Spirit of God dwell in you, that if any man have not the Spirit of Christ, is not of it. Spirit, capital letter. Flesh, small letter. That is to follow the Spirit, is to be living again. But to follow the flesh, is to be living again. As men that are led by the Spirit of God, we are the sons of God. We are the daughters of God. That is, be led A by the Spirit B equal to Son of God C. Be led A, A plus B, B is equal to C. Be led A, that is capital A. Be led by your person. B means the Spirit. Be led by the Spirit. They are the sons of God. John Matthew has he said, as men have received he gave them power to become, not to look like, not to become a good couple, but to become a son. What we are trying to establish here is not this is the more we worship God, the more we look like him. What are the benefits of worship God? Worship only is open you up to unlimited revelation. You don't have what to say. You don't just arrive and think that you can do it like that way. No. Some people wrong to do business, do ministry when they are not the city packing from the body. That is not the essence of worship. Worship in direction. Worship with you in the place where God has prepared. And finally, worship, benefit of worship, worship focuses on the divine supplies. Supply of insight. Supply of SNS speed. If you wait, check yourself, you are the number one cause of it. But when God created God said you are a very good specialist. He said that God created by his thinking. And when God said they are very good. That is to say, you are created to become good. You are created to break good. You are created for people to see God to you. And when they see God to you, they can say God is good. And that's why I ask chapter 10, as I can say, I'm going to go to Jesus. Of Nazareth, the Holy Ghost in power. He went about being good and being a poor, eating all, all. He did not differentiate whether this one is a Muslim, this one is a Christian, this one is a Hindu. That is, he was eating all of them. And because the power of God was on him. That is, when it is on you, the grace of God, and in the relief they are not on you, the anointing gives you an edge among the things. So I want to pray for everybody that's here. That as we go into this form of worship of these techniques, we decree that there shall be access to revelation, yeah. access to lines, yeah. access to abundance of supply, yeah. access to the things that will make us to be distinguished. Yeah. And we believe it's not a win and shall be not a shame. Yeah. You are here, you are not born again. You are here tonight, you know you are not born again, not Jesus of God. I would like to place on your church when you pray for you right now. So, God, God, this way. 
porque a Tony foi forte na cruz, né? Se me não tinha os arabos, foi bem mais sim. A receita de Deus, eu te falei, eu te falei, eu te falei.